Good morning, we're using up more breakfast stuff. Uh, we had eggs left, chorizos, I made chorizo and eggs, no tortillas or anything because we're out. I had some leftover pinto beans uh, that has bacon in it from the other day, so I just smashed it, made a little bit of refried beans, and I wanted to use up this queso blanco, so I put a dollop on everyone's beans, and we also had pineapple to use up, so the girls are having Pineapple. Yeah, so, yeah, so it tastes like cheese. You might want to make that, but taste it with your finger, man. Cheese. So yeah, this is what having a leftover breakfast looks like, but hey, it works. Hey guys, from Splash Town. I'm sitting here guarding our seeds. The girls are already out playing. They've been in the wave pool. Andres is out there with Autumn somewhere, and I unfortunately don't have a tampon to go swimming with. I know, TMI, I'm so sorry, but it's my life. Andres is like, you want me to go to the store? So, it is what it is. So unfortunately, I will not be swimming today, but I have a really cute dress from Old Navy on. So, you know, there's that. <laughs> it could be worse, I guess.
others are still out there playing. I'm taking a little bit of a break. I have reapplied sunscreen like 45 times. And I still feel like I'm getting sun. So that's okay. I'm so glad I actually got to go out and got I got to swim and I it's been a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Autumn's already done for the day though. Oh thanks baby. Office Depot like I said to drop off the binding I'm so glad I did um, but I have I need new glasses anyway so I'm here to check out what they have you know I love the ones that they have here those are fun I'm leaning towards those but oh there's a purple pair I think that's all I see okay I went with these same one I actually think I've had I don't know if they had the mirror though I've had the tortoise from there before. Ten dollars. Ten dollars make you holla. Can't beat that, seriously. So, uh, and it worked out perfectly because I needed some. Anyway, I actually have a pair that I bought from Goodwill that have a pink band, but they're black frame with black. Um, they're not the mirror. So I'm going to take these and those as backups. I'm definitely, I, I hardly ever, actually, maybe one time, I hardly ever take expensive sunglasses on vacation. Um, just because so like my Ray-Bans I'm not taking my Ray-Bans plus I like the plastic frame so I can push them that's probably why they break because I push them in my hair a lot um, but yeah these are the ones that I went with and then I did get to drop off their autograph books it was $13 I mean you really cannot beat that cannot beat that 13 bucks to get them cut I didn't even have to cut them and bound 
hand and then he's also putting a back like a plastic back on it and I had him put a blank sheet of white cardstock and I will have them decorate them however they want on the plane that'll be something really cool for them to do um, we can put a picture in it later anything some you know I have the little zip ink paper so that'll be cool if they want to do that and for dinner we decided to go home and have leftovers so we have spaghetti and pizza and fruit that's what is going to be for dinner tonight good night see you tomorrow her hair is just long enough to put in a french braid and we're detangling emmy's hair for her appointment tomorrow i wanted to do that so i only did a few um sections and i still have a lot of hair to do yeah we're about to get in here and bust it up because it's bedtime. Look at how red and swollen their eyeballs are from swimming all day today, too. It's definitely well, mine, bedtime. Mine are not. Yeah, they are. <laughs> because I was swimming with my eyes closed, I think. And then that made no glowing get in my eyes. Okay. All right, it's bedtime. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. And Adam. Good night. See you tomorrow. Okay, I am in bed going through my purse. I am packing up my Massimo Floral Beauty for the trip. I am using this. Of course, I'm taking my fanny pack for the actual Disney trip because I don't want to carry it. Although this is very tiny crossbody. This was from Walmart, I believe. It's a wallet on a chain type of thing. I think it was like 10 bucks. Obviously, I love the floral pattern. Very spring, but it doubles as a wallet two and then on the inside it has two zippers that are just open I am so that if it's still available I'll try and link it remember to link it down below and then I think my mom got this from Amazon I saw it in her car one time and I was like where'd you get that cute mini backpack I was going to take my glittery my gold glittery sparkly one and I was like no I'm gonna take this one so this is actually kind of like a hiker Okay, let's try that again. My battery died. This is like a workout jogger type little backpack. It has the place where you can take your headphones and stuff out of it. I don't know. I think she got it from, I want to say Amazon, but she may have got it from one of those things that pop up on your Facebook page. Um, but it's just a little tiny backpack. It has two compartments, has a little like water bottle holder thing. So I think I'm going to take this and you can actually... And turn it into it has a back zipper too that's kind of cool you can turn it into a single strap like the straps are detachable or a little mini backpack so I think I'm gonna take this and then use this as a wallet just because tomorrow I'm going to not take my big purse around but I still need my cards and things like that so I'm going to use that as a wallet and this also has detachable I'll probably leave it on there for the time being but it has detachable strap and you can just use it as like a wristlet so that's what I'll probably do carry this around when we're doing anything besides actual Disney like when we're at the parks I plan on wearing my fanny pack to put my phone and the gift cards and things like that my ID different things in my actual fanny pack um, but for the remainder of the trick trip I want to take that mini backpack and this in case I just need to grab and go I can detach it I don't have to use it as a crossbody or I totally can so my purse has a lot of lot of junk in it so much junk I'm like not even looking forward to it I have four three or four shows that I want to watch before I leave I doubt tomorrow I'll have time tomorrow my I, my plan is to be up super early it is currently 10 09 I want to try and be in bed before midnight so I probably won't get to watch all of these shows but Emmy's hair appointment is at La Quintera and it is at 9 30 in the morning and I'm sure it'll take several hours so I'm gonna pick up my mom so that she can help me with the girls because on the desk works all day tomorrow and um, yeah we'll probably grab lunch or something there but I still want to get a pedicure. My toes are looking ragged. I've given up on my nails. I can paint those here. I can paint the girl's nails and toes here or on the plane or something. Like I'm not that worried about it, but I need a pedicure. They're very, very bad. Very bad. And I also kind of wanted to get a haircut. So I was thinking in the morning if I get up and wash my hair, 
then I can maybe get a haircut while Emmy's getting a haircut as well. Kill two birds with one stone type of thing. And we'll see. Maybe I'll have time after because my mom is taking Autumn with her since Andres won't be with me and we're going to Incredible Pizza. I don't want to have to worry about her running around. That's not really a place that she can run around without with just one adult trying to supervise all of them. So I am taking Maddie with me though. So maybe we can do pedicures in between that and incredible pizza. I don't know. It depends on how long it takes for Emmy's hair. I want to say last time I got it completely straightened, it took like three to four hours. I feel like that's how long it took. So I'm hoping because we detangled it and everything already tonight, we put in a mask, like an overnight mask. So when they wash it out tomorrow, I'm hoping it's not that bad to detangle and straighten because when I do it myself, it takes me about an hour to blow dry and an hour to straighten. So hopefully under three hours for the whole process. But because of that, I'm banking on being at the mall for a while. And then we still have to come home. I've pretty much packed everything. That's why I'm doing my bag. I'm multitasking while I'm watching my show. I'm doing my bag. But I've pretty much packed everything. And then tomorrow night after we get home, we'll probably be home from Incredible Pizza around 9-ish. I'll get them to bed. And yeah. We got some of the house cleaned up today too. Just a very tiny bit of it this morning. So it is what it is. If it does, If everything doesn't get done, it's not the end of the world. We'll come home and do it. I'll just be happy if our trip turns out amazing. <laughs> Isn't that what everyone wants for their vacation? So I don't know. Anyway, this vlog's super long and it will, let's see, be up and then we'll have one more vlog after this one that you guys are watching that'll schedule upload for you guys and then you won't see me for about a week and a half. It'll be so nice to just take a little bit of a break. So anyway, I'm going to get back to what I'm doing. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hope you enjoyed.